What we are doing in our group, it's all about solar energy. It's all about 100% availability of solar energy. Today, when you think about PV panels, photovoltaic panels and batteries, you can ask, okay, what happens when we don't have sun? What happens then? And the answer is that today we have to go to the grid and ask for electricity, which means that in practice we build two systems. We build the regular grid and we ask it to be a full backup for us. And in addition, we build what we call the renewable system, but the entire package is very expensive. What we are building here in our group is a technology that aims to replace fossil fuels and give us 24-7, 365 availability of green energy. It's a new thermodynamic concept. What we showed is if you take the solar radiation and focus it onto a photoluminescence material, it's absorbed the solar radiation and emit low energy photons that are good enough for the solar cell. What you gain is that you still have the solar cell operation. This is about 20% for the day, but we conserve 50% of the energy, additional 50% of the energy as heat. And this heat can be used at night for heat engine. So this way you have a single system that gives you 24-7, 365. Throughout the years I had students from GTEP. These are my main students that build these concepts. They are doing an excellent job. And what we are doing here is to try to make an impact, not an academic impact, a real impact. In light of the recent progress, we established a startup company from the group it's called the Luminescent Solar Power. GIPTEP also supported my lab funding, which was, of course, very helpful. It's allowed us to take risks in knowing that we have a financial support for a few years. By supporting faculty members that are dealing with the environmental crisis and attracting activities in this important issue, GTEP has a real impact, both at the Technion and in the national level and in the international level, and I hope that the GTEP will continue doing so.